Hey guys, it's Huff. I am back again and this is going to be the update for my Project Pan 20, 2020 type of thing with the theme of places. There are some other people who aren't using the place theme, but for me, I like to have a theme just to narrow down the stuff that I pick um, because I have a fairly large collection. Um, so I haven't finished anything uh, wasn't really expecting to um, but I would just go through the stuff that's in the project um, pretty much the only thing that might have changed a little bit are uh, lip liners I don't think I actually measured anything though so there you go um, I'll start with the three things that are in my uh, Z palette which is really dirty by the way looks terrible much better um, so we have Green Bay from Cargo which is actually what I'm wearing on my lids today we have a Caribbean Sea from Girly Cosmetics which I have used maybe once uh, yeah and we have the Havana contour which is also in my team project pan um, which has got a bit of a dent in it but other than that not much uh, the bronzer that I put in is the Clean Color Tanned Raw Bronzer, which is also in my Team Project Pan. Um, it keeps getting hard pan, so I have to scratch up the surface of it. Um, yeah, not my fave product. It may well get decluttered before the middle of the year. Then we have the eyeshadow stuff that I have put in. So the New York City Be A Bombshell quad um it's kind of hard to tell anything but i this is probably one of the products that i've used the most not that i've done makeup a lot um, i've used all of the colors uh, the green is actually what i have as my transition and the black is blended out on the outside corner the cream i used to set my primer and um, on the inner corner so i used most of that one today um what else do we have let me just turn my page uh the pigments um i have used all of them except i think the hollywood one so we have tokyo which is the purple one i did a fully purple look the other day um didn't really like it very much probably because i don't have any um super cool lip options in they're all like really um warm or on the warm side and it ended up being a really cool look like cool in tone not cool um the oh i didn't use this one uh fiji mermaid i haven't used not really expecting to finish the pigments quite honestly i just want to find a way to make myself use them at least a little bit um i have used uh lexington quite a few times I often use it as um, inner corner highlight because it's a good color for that because it's sparkly white um, and the Hollywood one is the full-on glitter um, and I'm pretty sure I haven't used it um, I also have in the eyeshadow if I can get the lid back on the pigment uh, from the Revolution Metallic Crush Pigment Palette, we have uh, Vegas, which is right there. Um, and I have used it, and it seems to be developing hard pan. Um, which, or like seizing, which is like, and the one, all of the ones that I've used seem to be doing that, which is kind of annoying there you go so moving on to pencils which i didn't measure <laughs> uh so we have the me in um eyeliner in emerald city which is just a green eyeliner i used it today um yeah i'm not very good at using up eyeliners and the lip pencil is a genoa from satin um yeah i this one is the lip liner i've used the most in the past month but as i said i didn't actually measure anything so 
yeah, I can't tell you how much I've used. I'm a great YouTuber. So, lip products. Uh, MAC Vegas Vault, which is in my pro Team Project pan. I have worn this a couple of times, um, but not enough that you'd actually notice. Uh, the Bay Balmain Instinct from L'Oreal. I have actually worn this. It's like a grungy green color. Super cool. Do love a grungy green. Uh, the other grungy green I wore this month, even though it's not in a project, is Brucey from Colourpop. And I love that. That's fantastic. Uh, Miami Red from J Cat. I uh, don't think I wore this one. I think it's only ever been swiped. Swiped. Swatched. That was the word I was looking for. The Ofra Lipid Lipstick in Laguna Beach I have worn. It's just a nude. I've actually worn more nude lipstick in the last month, mainly because the eye colours I've got are quite bold. Um, the uh, NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in Zurich. I'm not sure if I wore that one. Um, two more liquid uh, liquid suede from NYX in Orange County and Brooklyn Thorn. I've worn both of them, um, but like only once. And the lip gloss is the tinsel lip gloss from Revlon. On my lips at the moment is the Genoa lip pencil and this on top of it. It's literally what I'm wearing on my lips today. Um, yeah, so that is everything that is in the collection. As I said, nothing has been used up. I'm not really that surprised because they're all the kind of products that take bloody forever to use up, but that's fine. Um, I just enjoy having products that are kind of set aside to use. It makes it easier when I'm trying to be quick at doing something because I just have to open up my drawer. Otherwise, I have to go through several drawers in order to find stuff. So, yeah. Um, yeah, so that's it for this update. The other girls from the Geeks and Beauties who are doing it will be listed down below. So don't forget to go and check them out. If you want to subscribe, click the button down there. Click the little bell if you want to get notified of when I upload new content. Leave me a thumbs up if you like project type videos and leave me a comment down below. I will like your comment and I will answer any questions that you ask. And I'll see you in my next video. See ya.